position in the civil community you've come here. I know you're here as friends and colleagues of this enterprise, which has had a, such a firm place in our hearts and uh, minds over many, many years, and transplanting it here now, uh, like transplanting a large tree in a new place, requires a great deal of care and prayer, well watering, supporting, and you've done this today by coming here with your presence and your prayers. The God of Earth and sky, you visit the land and bless it. You greatly enrich it. Encircle this house with your grace, O God. May your blessing encompass these walls and peace be within them. We bless this space in the name of God, creating, redeeming, life-giving. Amen. Oh, you have to go over a Tennis, it may be able to. If we're too late, any for a motel, Momata to the Mori. How far get a Maharajo to Kiki for you to come to for a mind go to mind that I for a no, you may have a good. That is a meaning of the two. That is a thing, thank, thank you, our mayor. Alan, Wapa, and thank you to Bishop Martin and the Fare, all our ministers here, and all our people, our family, who welcome the opening of this wonderful building. And, and, and welcome all of you from the committee. Uh, the blessings and uh, the welcome from our Kamatur uh, are all part of the very large organization that's here. Um, I got uh, involved with this. I was at school with Bruce. Someone unkindly suggested that he must have been very junior to me. But, uh, <laughs> but I, 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 he wasn't that junior. Your phrase was I was lower down the food chain. Well, I, think, <laughs> I think we should go around. I think it's a good idea. If you're happy that I start that off. Just give us your name and what your role is and, uh, and we'll just go around that room. Peter Robertson, I'm a, I do the audit of the accounts and I also represent Kiki Rotary. Right. Hi, my name's Laurie Hobart. I represent uh, Kiki Lions and I'm also on the committee. I'm Jan Britton. Um, I council in town of Mahoe Street and I did used to work from um, Kaingaroha in Kiki. Um, I'm Suzanne. I work here as a councillor. I help with the holiday programme and I'm on the committee. I'm Rose Patmore, I'm just a supporter. Mm. It's lovely to have you. I'm Edith Yates, uh, we, I live in Kiki, and I just support. Good. I'm Barbara Barraclough, I live next door over the fence, but I also work as a volunteer from the police station with the neighbourhood support. I'm Olga Martik and I'm a neighbour from across the road. Lovely to have you. I'm John Dudley. I came under pressure from his death. <laughs> um, Michael, I'm, I'm Alan Livingston, Mayor of Waipa District, and could I just uh, say both thank you and congratulations, uh, uh, congratulations for this new venue, and thank you very much for the work that you do within our community. And I'd ask everyone just to have a look at the awards uh, certificates up there, because from a community perspective, that's a, uh, a very valid acknowledgement of the work that has been done on behalf of our community, for our community. Thank you. Oh, my name is Araha and I'm a backstop for Dennis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Hazel Robertson and I'm representing the St John's Anglican Op Shop who supports this organisation. I'm Helen Taylor and I work as a volunteer on Wednesday mornings. I'm Rita Moyer. I'm here representing the Citizens Advice Bureau and congratulations to Kainga Araha. We work very closely with Kainga Araha and we had many happy years mm. in this building. I think it's a wonderful venue for you. Mm. Congratulations. Thank you. Hello, my name is Jessica. And <laughs> 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 you're Stephanie and Dennis is. <laughs> 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 Someone's granddaughter. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> and mum and dad are doing Bruce, the filming. Bruce and James Randall. You will yes. get the impression we're a team here. Oh, yes. I'm Bruce, I'm one of the family members, and I'm, I'm shutting up now. <laughs> I would officially um, disputes officer. It's the best job I've had because they've never had disputes <laughs> in this happy team in Leicester. I've got work to settle. It's on going out. Just what I would. Hello, I'm Lord Levan and I'm just a supporter and we know I've been quite well. And I'm the good man. Or oh, the other half, if you like. Peter Levine's the name. Well known Jay-Z over this story. A couple of things I would like to say. <laughs> First, to assure our friends from Kiki around the corner that we have moved, but we have not lost the sense of connection, yeah. and we're not going to lose it. <coughs> um, it just means we're going to do a little bit more travelling at times when people out in our home district are in need. Up to now, it's been harder work for the Tawamudu ones. Now it's a bit harder work to stay in touch with people, but we're determined to do it. It's really important to say that. The uh, second thing I wanted to say was there are some of the people here who contributed to our lovely double page spread in today's Courier. Um, Peter, I think you're one of the people who's he is. the advertisement in. He, he, he got lent on. Michael did a lot of the work of organising that page, and thank you, Michael. And the last thing I wanted to say was a couple of weeks ago when we moved in, the house was silent. We said, we have to get a radio or something. It, it, it's empty. It was like the house was waiting. And it's really coming to life today with all of you here bringing the warmth, the aroha, the support. It's brilliant to have you all here. It's lovely to be here. I was thinking of my own association which goes back about 16 years when we did a little strategic planning exercise uh, 16 years ago. And I've been coming on and off every year and uh, it's become part of my life story and it's a privilege to be associated with this new chapter. Uh, yeah, I'm Stephanie. I work here. I have worked here for 20-something years. I just want to share with you a story about the old house in Kihikihi, which we're now renting out. And a lady, uh, a whanau, came the day before yesterday to have a look to see if they'd like to rent it. She walked in and she said, the wairua is good. Uh -huh. As she walked through the house, she said, this house has a good history. She could feel it. And... I was very touched by that mm. because that's what everybody has contributed mm. and I'm looking forward to the same wairua, that same aroha, that same contribution from everyone here and already this is a house full of love. So mm. My official title is the Reverend Mori Lusifare, but most people know me as Buddy Tafari. I actually know the power behind the scene that designed this house. Her name was Mary Morrison. The oh, wife sorry. of the Reverend Bill Morrison. She went on to design a similar parsonage at uh, Hillcrest, and uh, Bill was uh, a district superintendent. And I'm just so delighted that the memories of people like Bill Morrison and Wolf Cable and Bob Short and those who served the district in, from this house has just uh, been a, a very pleasant surprise. And uh, I came back from the Methodist Conference yesterday. And the uh, major topic of uh, deliberation and debate is where is the Methodist ministry going in its future role, mm. uh, along with the joint training program at St. John's Theological College and beyond that. And I suppose this was almost a, uh, uh, for me, a gratification that ministry never dies, where whatever role it takes on. And when a community group takes on that role, to be the ministers to the community, or whatever we, word we use, the servants to the community, to serve the community, then the place has achieved what it was built for. Mm -hmm. Kia ora. Hi, I'm Tanisha Hale, and I go. I come to the holiday programs here. Yes. And I say it's really good, and I always feel safe here. You're very welcome. Yeah. Yeah. My sisters, they both got a holiday program. Huh? I'm Tracy, I'm one of the. I've got a tear in my eye I'm very proud of her saying that. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm the mum, Tanisha and Molly. Yeah. They come on the holiday program, and um, I've just started being one of the volunteers. The mum sort of like mm -hmm. one of the leaders, and I've been, I was on the last holiday program, mm -hmm. and um, I've really enjoyed it. 
mm. and I'm hoping to give some more voluntary work towards mm. Kiwi House. <laughs> My name's Nellie person. Harris and um, I've been associated with the Kainga Other House for about between, I can't quite remember, up possibly as long as 18 years and um, had children come through the holiday programme, um, have been committee member from secretary to past chairman uh, and I'm so glad Michael's standing up there. <laughs> 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 and also a um, holiday programme leader, yeah. so yeah, that's me. George, lovely to have you here. I'm George Allenson from St John's Anglican Church here in Town Two. We're very uh, supportive of the community house and it's a real pleasure to be here with you all and I'm sure the move from Kiki into the centre of town was really the wise one and the time was right. It's mm. meant to be now mm. as it is. So I'm very supportive of it individually and from the church. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. Colin, just to fix it. <laughs> Part of a small cog in the uh, organisational machinery of the place. Thank you. Oh. Yes. Oh. I, I mean, I'm a volunteer for the last four years. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my name is April Bent. Um, my first memories of this place was when I came to board here and the time that jo um, Barbara and David Ansell were here as, as Methodist ministers. So I used to sleep in that room. So when I come back in here, it's kind of a bit weird. <laughs> Today I've come because I wanted to come because I run after you all. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, I belong to, I'm a councillor at the Rosetown Counselling Centre and I just um, officially am here to support you. Thank you. My name is Kana Yomada. Kia ora koutou, um, my name is Jenny Patching, I'm a community advisor with Social Services Waikato. Um, I'm getting to know Dennis and Bruce and Steph and Melody and everybody rather well. It's kind of cool actually, so I'm wrapped to be here today. I'm here to um, support you, offer you. Look forward to continuing to develop that relationship in the future and uh, many more conferences to come, eh, Dennis? Thank you. Kia ora koutou, I'm Andrea Gogol and I'm the uh, Chief Executive of Social Services Waikato and um, I came at Jenny's invitation and I thank you for um, inviting us and we are here to offer you and to celebrate this lovely home. Uh, I'm Keith Story from the St John's Anglican Church and I'm pleased to be here and I commend the team that have been involved in shifting to this new facility, it's a magnificent facility and uh, it's a major milestone in the service to the community and it really is tremendous. And I'm Rod Benton, the second representative from the Citizens Advice Bureau. But I've had, like April, my wife, I've had a, you know, the odd connections here and there. And I look at it as a real lighthouse in Kihiki, and the lighthouse has moved <coughs> now to here. And I say, Kia kaha, be strong. <laughs> my name is Melody Amon. I'm the family support for Kainga Aroha and also co director with Stephanie and Dennis and with our awesome volunteers and children and everyone also. Welcome. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and you know, you can do the cooking at camp. Oh, We've been the terrible <laughs> twins for about 12 years. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Really yeah. We were quite happy to help. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. This yeah. is yeah. Dr. Yeah. Yeah. Mum, Billy. And we've had behind us. Oh, hi, I'm Diane and I am a volunteer. I'm the volunteer that was on today. I made all that. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I am I I am I I am I 